They're voting my uh, I'm Jade and I'm Savannah it's October 18th 2013 and here are your announcements can you match the man hand check out the posters in the cafeteria hall in the cosmetology room to enter your guests only 25 cents a guest all proceeds go to breast cancer awareness so get your ballot to guests at cosmetology room 125 today how many lives <laughs> Can the Earth of Odin Vikings save? Our collection target is 32 units of blood. It can take up to 5 units a week to help someone with cancer. We are hosting a blood cl clinic, donor clinic, in the small gymnasium on Thursday, October 24th from 8.30 a.m. to 11.30 a.m. And we are counting on your support. Did you know within existing eligibility rules, it is estimated that in 1 in 2 Canadians, can give blood last year, only one in six did. We need you to help close the gap. Attention to all prom committee members. A reminder that today is the last day to hand in your fundraising er, orders and money to Miss Jordan, Miss Jones, and Miss Tufford. They need to be handed in by the end of the day. Once again, prom members must return fundraising orders and money today. In football action yesterday, the Vikings played against Woodstock College at Athletic Park. Woodstock College would open the game with a 10-play scoring drive to go up by a score of 6-0. to zero. Kevin Earhart would even the score on Arthur Bowden's first play of offense with an 85-yard touchdown run. College, Woodstock College would once again score after six plays to put the score at 12-6. to six. Brennan Cunha... I think, would make the score 18-12 to 12 with a 15-yard touchdown catch from Kevin Earhart. On the first play of the second half, Kevin Earhart would run 90 yards for a second score of the game. The defense came out and shut out Woodstock College during the second half. Billy Bellinger, Eric Lamb, Dan Huber, Brennan Wanamaker, and Chris Lenz played very well during the second half shutout performance. Unfortunately, the hole that was dug in the first half was too big to come out of, as the Vikings dropped the game by a score of 26 to 18. Eric Lamb was critical to the Viking offense with several key runs for the first downs and a strong second half on defense, and Will Easton ran extremely well throughout the game, including a critical run on th third down. Don't forget your meeting in the big gym at lunch. United Way Football, United Way Football. The game has officially been rescheduled. Yes, that's right. We have the Football Red Feather game booked for this coming Monday, October 21st at 11 o'clock. All of you who had purchased tickets already have spots booked on the bus. The bus will leave at 10.15 and you will be demitted at 10 o'clock to get ready and on the bus. Now here is a Halloween video to promote the dance. Alright, see it Later.
Anyone interested in the Oxford Robotics Competition, go to Mr. Goodwin's room at lunch. Bring your lunch if you need to. Jazz band rehearsal is after school on Friday to make up for the missed Monday rehearsal. The cheerleaders are reminded to see Miss Devon by 12 o'clock today with their chicken fundraising money. There is no practice today. Again, no practice. White chicken. Dear. The menu is tomato, vegetable soup, or cream of broccoli. The Texas burger. The hot sandwich is a meatloaf vegetarian, and the vegetarian is a veg pasta. The Avalon is steak sandwich. Well, that's all we have for today, Bowden. I'm Savannah. And I'm Jade. Have, have a fantastic, fantastic Friday. Friday.